are you doing today? Today on the Belsa Show, we're gonna work on Mom's key we are a little bit. We're gonna do some rust restoration along there, boys. No idea why she's rusting there. And I have a new Kia sign right from Kia, boys, for the back. So this thing is not so cocked over. And then we gotta try to buff this up and do this and that and the other thing. First thing we're gonna do is put you somewhere where you can fucking see what's really going on. That'd be the first thing you do. There we go, that's better. So first thing we need to do is get this off, we do. And uh, I'm hoping I don't have to take all this shit off. I'm hoping she'll just pull off, boys. So let's just get something here and yank the hell out of her. So what I'm gonna use, hopefully, is a pick tool and a bone, boys. We call these a bone, we do. So we're gonna get under it, maybe, a maybe, without scratching the shit out of the piece. Oh, boys, I think we might have to pull her apart, I do. Yeah, man. I think I'm gonna have to take the whole pail apart and remove that. So let's do this rust protection first. So what I'm gonna use for this is this tool, boys. Okay, freaking right I am. So we're gonna get this grind down to metal, and then I'll show you what else we do from there, even though I'm not a body boys. I'm not a body boy, boys girls peoples don't forget to subscribe and like and hit that notification bell bar button if you like how not to do body work with bell stuff we're gonna eat better oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> all right so now that we have that pretty much out of the metal what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna coat it with some of my goo so i'm gonna use the old plexi coat rust converter i am so we'll give this a wipe down let it soak in. We'll give her a first coat, boys. And then we'll uh, work on the little doodaddy and we'll come back to this, we will. Freaking right, we will. But this stuff seems to work not too bad, it does. You can see it go to work right away as you wipe her in, boys. She'll slow her down anyways. It's not like this hatch. You can really see too much of it from where it is. So there you go, boys. There's the first coat, eh? Check it out. That's not too freaking shabby. See how it's already going black? It's eating the rust, hey? It's having a freaking eat fest it is. So now that we're done that, shut this for now, and we're gonna open the gate, and we're gonna pull this thing off. So we're gonna have to remove this inner panel, which is uh, pretty straightforward. Freaking right, it is pretty straightforward work. Where'd my pick cool to go? So first thing you wanna do is remove the clips, boys. Stuff all over the camera I do from grinding. There you go, how's that feel? We're needing another little tickle tickle. There you go. Now it shows a screwdriver, but they're stripped. So all you gotta do, boys, is pull the clips out like this and they come right out, they do. So we'll take off the covers that cover the screws for the hatch cover, and we'll remove the one on the corner over here like so. So what we're gonna need is a star handle screwdriver and seven or eight mil. So that feels like it might be too small, boys. So I just gonna grab for Frank's sake, eh? Careful, boys. Check out the freaking hot rod, eh? Hot rod he is. Old Chevelle boys. Nothing like a good old Chevelle, some say. What the fuck size are these cock knockers? Just giving her, bud. Nothing like a good old burnout, boys. So there we go. The handle's off at two ten mils. Pull this screw out like so. And now we should be able to uh, remove the old panel ski. Oh, there's two more screws in behind these friggin' panels. Pull them off. Friggin' right we did. So that's off. So now what we're gonna need is 10 mils, boys. All right, that's enough of that. Holy. All right, so on here, it's got some lights here. The old lights are rooskies for the old doodad of rooski for license plate cover. Here, let me put you back so you can see what's really freaking going on. So you gotta unplug these. There's one. There we freaking go, eh? Slide that off. And Bob's your friggin' uncle. So now those are off, and that's off, and that's off, and that's off. It's got some clips there that are real cocks, but we should be able to pry her off, boys. If you can get to these little clips and squeeze them, that's your best route to get them off. But 99% of the goddamn time, boys, you can't fucking get to them. So we're just gonna have to make her come off. Give her a tap. There you go. A little tap -a -rooski. There it is. These are the clips I'm talking about. They're just a cock. And you weren't even watching, were you? Those clips are a cock, boys. But they didn't break, we got it off. And all we can do is remove that doodad. So how I'm gonna do that is, I have no fucking clue, boys. You're gonna have to push on it really hard here or heat the hell out of it. Let's heat the hell out of it. I like that idea. So we'll heat the hell out of this and see if we can't get it pried off, boys. Got two way tape behind it and they're just a pain in the ass sometimes they are. Should have just painted this Kia thing instead of pulling all freaking apart. What would you have done? Leave your comments below, why wouldn't you? Figure it better. Eat her up, boys. Get that glue soft, why wouldn't you? 
So I didn't need to take all this off to change the Kia sign, just so you know. And I know you guys are going to comment below because I took the thing off. But hey, boys, I want to buff that up anyways and see yours off. So we got this thing pretty hot now. It smells pretty good. So we should maybe be able to push her off. Oh, something's happening. Something's happening. Oh, we had her. What do the Chevelle's just freaking giving her all over the place he is? He's making a ruckus. Hey? He's going to get himself in trouble. We are going to win. There it goes. There you go. Garbage. So now we gotta roll all this old two-way tape off. Just use your finger, but watch out. You can tear the shit out of your finger doing this too. I got a thing at work, it's called a rubber eraser, and it's made for taking two-way tape off. Should've brought it home, boys. It's like a, a, lot, a rubber band that goes in a drill. Give her, and she just rolls her right off, she does. But hey, that's at work, and I'm at home. So that's not gonna do me any goddamn good right now, is it? Except for make me think to myself, what the fuck? But he's driving like an ass he is. Like, I, I hear you, man. It's fun to do burnouts and stuff, but holy, what's really going on? Careful. What a pain in the ass. All right, so now that I got this off good enough, freaking right, it's good enough. We're gonna heat the two-way tape up on here and stick her on. We are. So we'll pull that off and we'll heat her, boys. If you heat up the two-way tape, it does want to stick a little better than if it's cold. Don't need a lot, just enough so you can barely hold the goddamn thing. And then we'll take her, line up the holes, push her on, boys. There you go, look at that, eh? Brand new Kia sign. Friggin' right. So now I'm gonna get some, some buffing compound, see if we can't buff that up a little bit, because I don't know what the hell happened to that. It just, that's cocked right over. So we don't have much kicking around here, but what I'm gonna try on that is bag and aluminum polish, even though it's plastic. But we're gonna give her a shot, boys. We'll give her the old white Baruski, and I'm thinking it's not gonna work, because this thing is just stained big time. That, it needs a new one of them too, it does. I don't know what the hell happened to that, like. What is actually happened to that? Holy. Well, it's a friggin' 100% better, but still not good enough. We'll just keep on rubbing, Jim. The good stuff they put on the roads here in Ontario causes that. They put down a liquid stuff now, and it eats through everything. Should send the friggin' government the bill for this. Friggin' right I should. What's really going on, government? It's like causes cancer too. So just so you know, there ain't no coming back from that. That is just cocked over, boys. It needs a new one, and I ain't doing it. So we got the key of something on. We got this all cleaned up a little bit, and we're going to stick her back on we are because it's starting to get dark out, and I ain't going to dick around with this thing forever. So that's back on. So now we can open the hatch rooski and bolt her back up, boys. Give her the old bolt job. I'm fine? No, I'm not, actually. Fucking thing's a pile of shit. Hey, it gets me where I want to go. It's a great car. Like, this thing is just absolutely fucked. I've tried every kind of cleaner I have on that, and it will not clean up. Thank you. I guess that's garbage now. Freaking right it is. I just get frustrated, because everything is fucking garbage nowadays. Let me hold something. No, I don't. Hold Get away from me. Hope I didn't forget something, because she come and started talking to me. Probably did. Like I said, she come out talking to me, I forgot something. The things we do for our wives, boys, girls, peoples, and husbands. All this for a freaking Kia sign. Even though I made it harder on myself. There you go, that ain't your part's done, so now we can get back to the body work, eh? Hey? Why wouldn't we? Well, boys, I had a collar a night, I did. I didn't get very far, but I got some primer on top of it, eh? Just primed her up real quick. She's a real rough deal. I had to wipe off some overspray there and this and that and the other thing, boys. But uh, other than that, good enough. Friggin' right it is. At least there's no rust there now. It just needs to be same color as a vehicle. Okay, so we'll get some paint for that. And we'll give her a quick... Ch -ch -ch. You can see where somebody's already painted this hatch anyway. See that? Friggin' right you can. Why wouldn't you? Can you believe that? They painted that. They did a real good job of friggin' doing the rust restoration on that, didn't they? What's really going on, bud? Hey? But anyways, boys. Not much else to do right now. But anyways, hopefully you liked this video and uh, you hit that thumbs up. And notification bell bar button, boys. Freaking right you do. Until next time, you know what to do for now.